Jay? Jay, you're here. I've been calling you. Sweet, are you okay? Oh, not again. You're still crying. Come, come. It's fine. It's okay. If you keep crying like this, you'll fall sick. It is you and yourself. Come, come. It's alright. It's, it's okay. It's fine. Everything will be okay. Alright? You know, your mom left for reasons best known to her. But I want you to understand that I'm here for you. Okay? <laughs> Sweet. It's okay. You can always visit me, okay? Why? You can always come to Port Harcourt anytime you want. If you want me. I understand. It's okay. I miss my mom. I miss her so much. Titiri pakakali à la douche. Drakata makato sekaka. Tout à l'âme sanda. Tout à l'âme sanda. Liva saba fomi. Tout à l'âme sanda. Liva saba fomi. Evangelist Jetty is around. Capro l'âme sanda. Let me not be the one to distract their prayers. Liva saba fomi. Capro tout à l'âme sanda. Tout à l'âme sanda. Ah, Chief Alabo. Evangelist. As the voice of God over this house, you shall remain my son in the Lord. Therefore, I decree. Go and prosper. Amen. The Almighty God give you whatever is your desire. Amen. Yes. 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 My evangelist, I cannot thank the Lord more for the good things he has done for myself and my family through you. 
As a result, I would like to make a request. Just one request of you. And the Bible says, Seek, and ye shall found. Ask, ye shall receive. Knock, it shall be opened. For whoever that asks, receive it. Chief, the heavens are open to hear your request. What is that request, my son? Thank you, my evangelist. You see, there is no way I can thank the Lord more than to do something to sow a seed that will provoke God. You have done so much for my family. So I will need you to look around the city and look for a land in a very nice location that can accommodate a befitting five-star church. Yes. I want to build for you a five-star church as my, you know, the seed I sow and also to appreciate God for the good things you've done. Don't bother yourself about the money. I, mean, I Alagbo Briggs, am up to the task. I am going to pay for everything that it will cost to build a five-star church for my evangelist. <laughs> Receive that grace. Receive the grace. Amen. Receive the grace. Amen. Chief. Yes. It is said that the absence of wisdom is the presence of losses. That's true. Chief, you must understand that we are the church in quote. And moreover, God has not asked me to raise a church for him. Well, if he does, I will let you know. But for now, I am the church of worship. It's all right. Um, you know, I shall be traveling. I need you to ask the Lord to show you the direction. As soon as I return, I need a concrete answer from you. Okay? That's a good one. Okay. I, I must be on my way right now. All right. I yeah. have my evangelism scheduled to meet up. That's right. Jen Yes, Daddy. See my five star evangelist. Oh, off. Yeah, oh yes, you're going to coordinate the logistics. Yes, yes. Yeah, you will arrange for the talk boat that will uh, pull the badge. Sorry, can I, can I talk to you for a minute? Yes, sir. Good day, sir. Um, good day. I'm sorry to disturb you. Um, Chief is like a role model to me. Can I please take care of his bills? Oh, really? That's nice. Yeah. Sure, yeah thank you very much. Uh, please. Is it Chief's bill. So. Like, it's mine. Or just okay, that one, the decade free services should thank take care much. of all that. It's all right. Um, Alagba Briggs is my name. Brother, you don't need to bother. Someone already took care of your bills. Really? Yeah, one young man. One young man? I was told you paid my bills for the period of time I will stay in this hotel. Is that correct? Yes, sir. Hmm. Why would a young man like you be this generous? Zig Ziglar once said hmm. that you can have everything you want in life if you help people get what they want. I see it as an honor 
and a great privilege to do, to do it for an honorable man like you. And to get your undivided attention. Attention? Well, you've gotten it. You see, young man, I have never received any gift from any young Nigerian all my life. All you hear them say is, uh, Alabo, your boy is there here. Anything for the boys? Which not suits me. I have always been at the given end. But this is an upset. Well, as you know, I am Alago Briggs. This is my card. Feel free to contact me anytime you need my attention or maybe you need something for me to do for you. Thank you, thank you very much, sir. <sighs> but she fell over breaks. When it comes to supplications, it's not just the prayer of or the fate of the prayer leader that is needed, but the fate of the prayer receiver. Though war is fought with weapons, but one with wisdom. Hmm. Young man, you are confusing me. I mean, you are being philosophical. And I cannot comprehend why you are telling me this. With all due respect, sir, if you need further explanations to my saying, you can also reach out to me. Yes, I can't, sir. Hello, sir. Hello, yes, Mr. Alagwa Bridge. Yes, this is Fina from Subride Agency. Yes, sir, we are at the hotel now. Okay. Okay, we'll be with you shortly. Okay, sir. Um, we're here to see Chief Alagwa Bridge. Oh, for a moment. Okay. Hello, sir. Yeah, this is the reception. Please, are you expecting any visitor? Okay, sir. Thank you. Um, dear, please take them to Mr. Alabo's break room. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome, sir. Ah! Evangelic <laughs> gentle. Hey! Evangelic gentle. I've been mean, missing your call room. Now I can't try to come back. Now no come get you again. Not married at this your age is not a good testimony. And if I be a man of God of which I know I am, takataka shetiri pakala kala kalu shetira. I hear the Lord telling me this moment to place you on 14 days dry fasting to avert the plans of the enemies concerning your marital life. To talam sanda, chakata la ba 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 ba. The fasting begins from now. Ta -ta -ra -ra. Receive the grace. Amen. Receive the grace. Amen. Receive the anointing. Amen. Receive the grace. Amen. Ta -ta -ra 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 
Receive that grace. Amen. Go and be blessed. Amen. The God of evangelism to God remember me today. Me, God of Evangelic Gento, don't remember me today. God of Evangelic Gento, power, power, you don't remember me today. God of Evangelic Gento, you don't remember me today. You are from um, Soft Right Agency, right? That's right, yes, sir. Good, you're welcome. Thank, Thank you. you, sir. My name is Fina. I am going to be your driver. I'm Hillary, the personal assistant, sir. Good. Yeah. Um, the receptionist will take you to your rooms. I have uh, taken the liberty of booking two rooms for you. Oh. Um, no, sir, we don't need two rooms. I may work for the same agency. We could share the same rooms. It's, it's, it's okay, sir. We would actually accept it. Thank you so much. Thank you. I respect your privacy. Thank you. Yeah. So, um, she will take you to your rooms. And uh, feel free to order for anything. You can use the landline, food, drinks, whatever. Okay. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. On my account. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right? Okay. Shall we? Okay. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Mirabe, let me just call you here, so. Mm -hmm. We can just advise you small. You, you know, say, for this house, this Alabama house, let me bring you come. Now, stay me, now I carry you like this. Go give. Alabo, he can adopt you like your own biological daughter. You see, Jane, where is this? Make, you see, two of them are at all. No, the same. We are not the same level at all. So, we can make you just the respect and small. You hear me? Just the respect and small. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait. Are you done with your stupid counsel? Huh? Do you know, had it been you used this precious time to advise yourself, you wouldn't have ended up here as a gate man. And better still, you would have been married by now. Hmm? And let me remind you that your job in this house is as a security man, not as Mr. Advisor. So try to, like, mind your business for once. And hold on. So that's why you even called me out here. Eh? That's how you, why you called me out here. You must be sick upstairs. Huh? Nonsense. See, oh. See, person who I want advice, making life better. Now you come now, come they tell me, say, me, I don't know what now they do. Don't worry. No problem. Okay, let me see Sir, this Sir, we're ready to leave. I don't just want to jump into it. Let me see how it is. And he showed me a result, like Sir, two days after. And Omo, rather than sit down and analyze and be paralyzed, I said, dive in. And I did. I bought one of the bots, three different categories of the bot. There's the alpha bot, there's the super bot, and then there's the beta bot. I went for the beta bot because that's... Artificial intelligence is where the world is going towards us, sir. 330 something dollars in the first week and I was thinking this is not serious and in my second week I did 700 dollars I showed him the result and he said no there's something I'm doing that this thing I said nothing easy work but let us not just dive into that and have money scattered your head let me take it a little bit back so that we can go forward better how can you tell me that there is a, a robot somewhere in the outer space or the, the cyberspace that is trading and making money for me. I see this to be one of those Ponzi schemes. Good day, sir. Good day, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. So let me give you more clarity on that. Okay. You see, FXBT is an automated trading robot which allows you to experience an unlimited passive income flow from the foreign exchange markets with a cap of over $6.4 trillion daily. Now, this product also allows you absolute control of your funds. Yes, and also this product allows you to access your funds from anywhere at your fingertips. I have actually used it and I've actually discovered that um, you can actually choose A or any broker of your own choosing. Well, my initial conclusion was that this is one of those bronze schemes out there. No, no. Now, by the way, 
how come both of you are so conversant with this new product <laughs> that uh, you could proficiently explain it the way you did? Well, it's actually not new. It's something that's been used and people have benefited from. I mean, most of our staff actually use I actually use it as well. If you want, I could show you my own um, robot trade. So you use it yourself? Absolutely. <laughs> How are you? Fine. I miss you so much. I miss you too. <laughs> um, where is everyone? Where is Jane, your sister? She stepped out with the other guard for her weekly shopping. Weekly shopping? Yes, Dad. <laughs> Must she shop every week? Hey. Of course. She needs to look good for you. Mm. However, mm. Dad, mm. I got the perfect right agency for you. You did? Of course I did. Mm. Let me show you. Um, this is the app. This is Soft Ride Agency. Mm. Among all the ride, the ride agencies online, I've got to know that their premium pack comes with um, pilot and personal assistance. So this mm. for me is their competitive advantage. Pilot and personal assistant. Yes, dad. It shock you, Abby. He shock. <laughs> daddy, you know, daddy. You know, I'm a young boy. <laughs> daddy say it shock. He shock. <laughs> uh, but um, daddy. Yes. I'm still having only one challenge with them. Challenge. Yes. What is it? Um, the only available premium pack mm -hmm. for next week is just those ones that comes with the female pilot. Female pilot. Yes. And what is wrong with that? Is that a challenge? <laughs> yes, that is a very big challenge for How me. How is it a challenge? You women, you always say that whatever men can do, women can do much more better. Daddy. Much more better. <laughs> so, ah. What's wrong with that? Eh? It's okay. See, you know what you'll do? What? Book them for seven days. <laughs> Then my daughter is very smart. As a matter of fact, she recommended your company to me. Oh. Yes, among the numerous ones we saw online. <laughs> yeah. Your daughter is a very intelligent young woman, trust me. And our company should give her bonus for actually referring you to us. She would love that. <laughs> well, 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 well. I think you've convinced me. Yes, I will purchase the robots. Okay. I mean, whatever is worth doing, is worth doing now. Absolutely, yes. sir. Yes. So, get prepared. Uh, within the next 45 minutes, we should go to your office. Thank you, sir. Yes. Fantastic. Right. Thank, Thank you, you. We'll wait for you downstairs. Yes. Okay. Right. Thank you, sir. Mirabil. Mirabil. Why are you still insisting on sharing my man with me? Why? Are you trying to tell me that of all the men in this world, you cannot find anyone suitable for you? Tell me. Jane, why, why are you still wasting your precious time on this matter? Hmm? Remember, two things are involved. It's either I reveal the whole secret to daddy on his return, or... <laughs> or what? Mm -hmm. Or what, Mirabel? <laughs> You're going to tell dad that I'm in a relationship... <laughs> Mirabel. Mirabel, why are you doing this? This is not wickedness. You know I'm in love with the evangelist. You know I'm in love with Gentle. I love him so much. And I love him too. <gasps> Mirabel! <laughs> Mirabel, okay, Mirabel, please. You know, your sister. Please don't 
do this, please. Then, allow me to continue with my own prayer section with our five-star evangelist. Mm -hmm. Fine. Fine! Good. Then let the prayer section begin. This cannot happen under my watch. Why on earth would Fina accept different rooms if she had no ulterior motives with the chief? She has not stopped cheating on me. I thought she had. This cannot happen while I am here. Not under my watch. Come in. Hi. What's going on? I don't understand. Look me in the eye and tell me there's nothing going on with you and Chief. What are you talking about? Why were you so much in a hurry to get in there? Why didn't you wait for me to come? Hilary. I've always told you that your biggest problem is trust. If you're not careful, you're going to end up with high blood pressure. Do I leave or do I stay? I think you leave. learning experience meaning you can ask questions and you can gain more clarity about what the forex market is all about does that make any sense would you prefer to attend a class where you are not given a chance to ask questions or you would prefer to be able to ask questions and gain more clarity which one is better to be able to ask questions right so with the itu tv you have a unique chance to ask questions, gain clarity, and be able to make money. Now, let's talk about profit zone briefly. The profit zone is basic forex trading. And when we say forex trading, it's not something that is very, very out of this world. Are we together? Forex trading is exactly what you and I are doing every day. How many of you have gone to bureau the change to change money before? How many? okay you just did forex trading you did manual forex trading are we together that's exactly what you're doing every day comes up to a tune of over 6.8 trillion dollars per day and this money is available for you and i does that make any sense now those that have no idea about this money don't make a dime from this money. Those that know little about Um, young lady, please come. How are you? I'm good. 
This is the second time I'm seeing you here. Do you work here or you are a guest who lodged in here? I've been here for some days now mm. and I'm still here. Good. My name is Briggs. Alabo Briggs. Mm. Um, this is my card. I would like to have a word with you in the one of these days. Okay? Okay. All right. The chief never had even intentions. Why would his room be next to hers? And we all men. I would never allow that happen. I'd rather lose my job than have a stranger make love to a woman. Never. Fina. Fina. Look. I'm sure Chief is in there. Open the door. Let me come in. Prove your innocence now. Fina. Chief in his room. Is there a problem? I just want to know if Chief is in his room or if he's in there. Bros, let me just find. Ah uh ah. -uh. Ah uh ah. -uh. Don't touch me. I work for Chief. So let me just kind of. Hey, it's okay. No problem. 
You don't want to leave baby. We'll stay here together now. You too. We man here together. You man there, man here. If you come out from here, you have to come through me. Abby? Let's see what pass you. I don't understand. They're all night. Out of there because I'm sure. Let me just, I want to collect something. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Elder, Ma. please sit down. My sit is done. Sit. My work has done here. Yeah. Elder, sit down. <laughs> My windows are still done. Even as I stand, as you see me. It's okay. Okay, ma. Anyways, I was told that you helped take me into the house last night while I was drunk and becoming uncontrollable. <laughs> It's okay. And that you also helped clean up the place and that was messed up with my vomit. Thank you very much. <laughs> I don't know if you allow me to say you go, go drunk, messed up every year. Let me go clean up, come out everything. What kind of a man are you? I mean, you are old enough to be my father, but yet you are so humble. You know what? For that, I would like to reciprocate the kindness. Yeah. Of course. So here is um hundred thousand era. Please. Well for who? Manage it. For who? It's for you, of course. For me? <laughs> Elder, it's for you, please take Why does it be like six months out of you? It's okay. <laughs> Mama, thank you. It's okay, you can go. Thank you. Thank you, ma. It's okay. Thank you, ma. Thank you, ma. <laughs> oh, that please go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, ma. Thank 
Oh, I like it when you do this. Let's yeah. go here. Man to know for the last time what's going on with you and she breaks. Hillary, because you've been there for me in times of my challenges does not give you the right to speak to me like that. How many times do you want me to tell you that there's nothing between nothing happened between me and she? Don't give me that crap. I came to your room last night. And all I could hear was morning and morning. I tried to get back into the chief's room just yesterday, but your security guy wouldn't let me in. I slept in front of your door. I don't know when you he came up, I'm sure he came out of your room at some point. Hillary, you know what? I can't. Chief might be very hungry right now, and you don't want his lunch to get cold. And the agency wouldn't want to know that oh, his Chief lunch is getting cold. so important right now, isn't if it? If you don't get into the car, I'll leave you here. You will leave me here. You will leave me here.
Like I don't get. What exactly do you expect me to do at this point? I believe you're not expecting me to destroy the relationship of trust I've built in this family. You know, if I was told that, I would be sharing my man with another girl. And not just another girl, my own sister. I would never believe it. All in the name of God forsaken trust, gentle. God forsaken trust. But you know what? I don't want you anymore. You can go have her. Do not hurry to decision, Mr. So, okay. I shouldn't hurry. <laughs> you know what? Gentle, leave my room now. Leave. I don't even want you. I don't. I don't want you. Get out. 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 I don't want to see you anymore. You're so evil. Just go. Because I told you to leave. Oh, babe, please look at me. Look at me. Look, look at the way. Do you, do you do you like the way I'm crying right now? Just just look at me. Do you like it? I love you so much. I can't stand you with me. I can't. Mean, I Hello. How are you? Fine, thank you. I'm really happy, please. Jesus! Can I have the MasterCard to this facility? What room number is on the book breaks? Huh? Sir, I need you to please swap rooms with me. Please. Are you drunk or something? No, sir. I'm sorry. I can't explain to you what is going on right now. Maybe later, but I need you to come with me now. Please. How dare you command me like that? What impetus? Sir, please. Now. You need to come with me now. Me? I... Be good. Shh. Yeah. Love is mine. Calm down, we are friends. If I notice any illegal movement, Hi. Hello. Can I do you please? Um, my name is Cynthia. I'm here to see your level breaks. Is he expecting? Uh, actually, yes. Yes. Hold on a bit. Let me call him. Um, actually. Who are you? Right now, your life is equivalent to 200 million dollars. Make a transfer to me, darling. To who? In order to do that, consider yourself, okay? <laughs> Chief, you need to go to my room now. Now, Chief. Hurry up, come, come, come to my room now. 
Has she gone? Chief! Now! Who is that? I want you to know that it's over between two of us, okay? We can still work together, that's fine. No, I'm sure we can be professionals. But it's over between two of us. What are you talking about? Are you not calling me a prostitute? Oh, you want to answer that? I came into this room yesterday and I saw the chief sitting on your bed comfortably. Oh, Chief. Sir, are you are you okay? Where's Fina? Then prove me wrong. Hillary, stop. You're bigger than this. Look, I was only doing my job. Don't give me that crap! Does part of your job include you riding the chief? Uh, Mr. Canvest, the condition of that transaction is not acceptable by me. Yes, if $200 is not added to the cost of each item, then I'm afraid. Uh, please, just hold on. Uh, please, let me call you back. Uh, my evangelist is calling. Yeah, evangelist, how are you? How is the home front? Well, it's all right. Um, as you know, your wish is always my command. I will book your flight right away. My pilot will be at the airport to wait for you. Okay? To have a safe trip. Thank you. Brother, you see why I wanted you to come to my place? I have a comfortable place where you can stay. And you were talking about security. Now see what has happened. Besides, security is of the Lord. Except the Lord watches a city. The watchman watched but in vain. It's only God that can secure you. This is not good at all. But it's all right. I can understand how you feel. I feel the same way. All right? Um, as for this uh, incident, the hotel management has assured me that they've put modalities in place to ensure that this kind of thing does not repeat itself. 
All right. So um, I'm quite confident of what they can do. But you've just mentioned the Lord. I agree with you 100%. Security is of the Lord. So my, my evangelist is uh, coming over to further fortify me. Yeah? yeah? Spiritually. My evangelist over the years has proven himself to be impeccable when it comes to prophecies and uh, divine instructions. Okay? So I'm quite confident that uh, when it comes, we'll be able to do something in, in, in that respect, okay? So don't, don't worry yourself, everything will be fine. It's all right if you insist, but I'm still not comfortable. I insist, my dear sister. It's okay. All right? Everything will be fine. Let's drink. Mm. Uh, waiter! Yes, sir. Come on, open this drink. Do I really feel like drinking? Ah, come on. <laughs> This is unacceptable. Can you just imagine that? If not for the courageous acts of Sina here, I would have been dead by now. Or be shot of some millions. Is this how loose your hotel is? Look, my friend, I am leaving this hotel this minute. What is it? We are sincerely sorry, Chief, and this will not occur again. On behalf of the management of this hotel, we will make sure we get to the root of this. I will promise you, it will never occur. Evangelist Gentle. This is one of several occasions she saved my life. You will attest to the fact that uh, I have never disobeyed any of your prophecies or divine instructions. But permit me to disagree with you on this. Yes. Are you by any means saying that someone who has saved my life on several occasions should be relieved of her duties? No, now. That is not fair. Chief. Chief. Yes. The Holy Bible declares that blessed are those who do not see but believe. Mm -hmm. Chief. Obedience is better than sacrifice. And to hearken mm -hmm. than the fat of rams. That I know. Chief. Oh, it's about time for my midday prayer. I must leave here now. Let me go to the room. Is that right? Chief, the Lord has instructed for the obedience of seals. You see, Chief. With all due respect, I think I'm having an opinion that is contrary to what the man of God has just said. Due to my profession, I've been trained not to trust anyone. So upon our arrival, I decided to plant some devices here and there, in Fina's room, Elari's room, even in the car just to monitor activities around this vicinity. Chief, I can tell you for free that there's nothing for you to worry about. As a matter of fact, Fina has your interest at heart. The only issue is Hilary. He feels you want to take Fina away from him. That's an act of jealousy. But not to worry, I've got my eyes on him. Brainbox. Yes, Chief. You are not far from the truth. Exactly, sir. I am not oblivious of the fact that Hillary is unnecessarily jealous and uh, has not been happy with me. Starting from the first day 
they arrived. When I told them that uh, I booked separate rooms for them. Well, I have told evangelists that uh, these people are not evil. Anyway, go and uh, tell my PO and my pilot that he should get ready. He should be leaving for a meeting by 2 p.m. Okay? Who is there? Who is there? It's me, Chief. Fina. Are you okay? I heard your voice from my room. I had a dream. The evangelist. I saw him. He pointed a gun at me. He had my both arms tied and my feet. And he tried to rape me. Hmm? My evangelist. Pointed a gun at you. Tried to rape you. Come on. Impossible. My evangelist cannot do that kind of thing. But I saw him. Are you sure? That is him you saw. This is never the best teacher. Especially when it has to do with the negative occurrences. This negative occurrence should be your best teacher. Three mm -hmm. negative to segment. That is if two of them are dead. Listen. Sir, you called me. Oh, yes. Yes, sir. This is it. Fina. Yes, sir. Look great. Thank you. Thank you, sir. <clears throat> I'm sure you don't know much about me, do you? No, sir. I was married at the time. Oh, okay. My wife left me and vowed never to return. Oh, I'm so sorry, sir. It's all right. I've tried everything I could to make her come back, but all to no avail. Mm. Well, there were certain qualities I saw in her that made me marry her. And those qualities, from my observation, I'm seeing in you. You are intelligent, full of vigor, and hardworking. Thank you, sir. Above all, you are astoundingly beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, sir. 
Thank well, you. oh yeah, you're welcome. You see, I have been contemplating and uh, I came to the conclusion to open up to you. Okay. Yes. I will need you in my life. So what I'm saying in effect is that I want to marry you. So I want you to think about it and uh, come back with favorable answer. Okay? <laughs> okay, sir. Um, first of all, I want to say I am very flattered that um, you see me like that. Thank you, sir. But, you know, I'm a very strong believer and I have to talk to my man of God about this. As a believer, I can't just take this step on my own. So you would have to give me some time to seek the face of the Lord. By all means. I mean, since you've been with me, you would notice that I'm equally someone who does not play with God. Yes, sir. Yes, I'm a believer myself. Yes, sir. So take your time. Okay. Hmm? Okay, sir. Okay, thank you. Right. We'll be waiting for you, sir. Okay. Cynthia, what are you saying? Fina called me and said plans have changed. That she's going to get married to the man, kill him and run away with his $200 million. <coughs> Look, in as much as I do not buy the idea, Fina is a smart one here. But this, this is really crazy. It's, it's... Listen, they say they bet at hand what ten in the bush. Let's, let's go ahead and have business. I don't know, but she wouldn't listen. I have told her. What, what is difficult? Get out this man, take the 20 million naira and go! Go out separate ways, but she won't listen, like... That is it! Let us go ahead! I can't understand the whole thing, I'm crazy! Go! <laughs> Don't wait one loss, you know they hear a master we soon know. Hey, okay. I said it though. <laughs> I, I, I can't understand this, I am just crazy! What is this thing? <sighs> <laughs> Mirabel. Yes? Okay, you wouldn't believe what just happened. Mission almost accomplished. Chief asked me to get married to him. Are you serious? You know what? I'll call you back, okay? Someone is coming. Okay. 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 Okay then. Okay, bye. Hey. <laughs> Mm. Babe, yeah. you wouldn't believe what happened. Now, you tell me, what country would you like to relocate to when this mission is done? Just tell me. Mention <laughs> any country of your choice. <laughs> you know, I can't wait for everything it has to be on. I know, right? I mean, that would be the happiest day of my life. Yes. <laughs> mm. I've observed you since you first stepped into my home. Since then, you've been honest and trustworthy. You have taken me as your father and Jane as your sister. Therefore, from today, I will adopt you as one of my biological daughters. Whatever I do for Jane, that I will do for you. Both of you will do your first degree and master's degree in London. So henceforth, see this house as your house. Chief. Fina. Sir. 
Hi. Um, I want to especially appreciate both of you for the best that you are. Oh, thank you, sir. Yes. <laughs> um, I guarantee you that any time I'm in town, I'm going to specifically request for two of you to work for me. <laughs> and indeed, um, anywhere in the world, so long as Soft Ride is operational there, I'm going to make use of that company. All right. uh, yes, meanwhile, I will need you to send me your individual accounts so that I can appreciate you for the good work that you've done. Oh, thank you very much, sir. Yeah. And we hope we'll serve you better when next you're in town. Good. Yes, <laughs> All right? Yes, sir. And, um, Fiona. Sir. Don't forget the request I made of you. Okay. Yes, Chef. I have not forgotten. I'll, I'll get back to you in two days, sir. Thanks, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you. Yes, I have to leave now because yes, sir. Yes, sir. I may miss my flight. Okay. All right. Okay. Be a good boy, right? I will, sir. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Ah. Ah. That is back. Daddy. My beautiful angels. You're welcome. Yes, how are you? Fine. Oh, you're yes. doing great. Mm. So, did you enjoy yourselves? Of course, Daddy, I did. Good. I did, Daddy. You did it? Yes, maybe she should be not sleep. Is that why she's fat and you are slim? Of course. <laughs> Daddy, on. don't mind her. Don't let's mind go, her. let's go, let's Daddy, go. Daddy, what did you get for us now? Don't worry, they're in the boots, okay? Okay. <sighs> Dad. Mirabel. You sent for me. Yes, I did. Um, I have observed that since I came back from my trip, you have been so moody. This is not the Mirabel I know. Where is the vibrancy? Huh? This is not my daughter that I know. What's the problem? God, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. I'm so sorry for everything. Sorry for what? What is the problem? Talk to me, what is it? Evangelist Gentle, the elder and I have been in your house for an undercover mission. Mission? In my house? Yes. So what is this mission? The mission is just to destroy you, everything, like, I want to take over everything that belongs to you. But I couldn't. I can't do it anymore. In fact, Dad, don't, don't touch me. I want you to squeeze your marriage proposal with Fena the pilot. Please, I want you to quit. Please don't go further with it. Please, Dad. Please. Mirabel. Dad. How come you are aware of my marriage proposal to Fina?
Now that we've established our presence through our agency at the Green Carrot Estate, I think we need, to, we need to pay close attention to Chief Briggs' residence. Elder, how has your experience been working with Chief for, for the past six months as a security? Ha! For these six months, eh? He believe in me. Where, where? He believe in me. Elder, believing in you is not enough. You have to make him trust you. If Chief trusts you, only then can we be able to execute our plans very well. And then that way we can send Mirabel in to be his house help. Um, great apology for my late arrival. But then, if our great establishment must be built on a solid foundation, we all must come to understand this great thing that to be trusted is a greater compliment than being loved. Again, now leave my presence. Leave! <laughs> no, leave! <laughs> How dare you? How dare you call my lie? After all you've done, you see how the temerity, the impetus to call my life, Fina. Okay. So all this hula baloo is about my wealth. You and your cohorts wanted to kill me and take over my wealth. All right. Now be prepared for me. You, your agency, any person that is involved in this plan to terminate me and take my wealth, you are going to rot in jail. Your agency will be closed down and everybody, including the directors, will rot in jail. Wait for me. Idiots.
The only person that could have done this is Mirabelle. I told you that her kind heart will land us into trouble one day. Now we've lost everything after spending many days of calculated trust game. I said this. Now look at look 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 at what it has cost us. I said this. We should have just gone with the 20 million naira and move. Now you see? You see what greed has done to us? Wanted to inherit everything, but now got nothing. Nothing! But I said this particular thing from the onset. But nobody would listen to me. Oh. Yeah. Are you looking at him? <laughs> so this is it. No, this is it. All these years of supposed humility, honesty, is for you to destroy me just because of my wealth. That is what... Devil. Devil. Okay. Now, be prepared. I've already called the police. They're on their way. You will rot in jail. Yes. Yes. Can you imagine? Can you imagine this? And look at that idiot. Go abandon him. Go abandon him. Idiot. There is power mighty in the blood. Hey, don't smoke my mountain. Don't smoke the mountain and do you, my prophet know how. Stop. Can you imagine this? Can you imagine You are still talking. You are still talking, idiot. You think we don't know your scheme? They've made confessions. You don't call you. I am called by God. I mean, who called? Who called? Who So this is it. No, this is it. Idiot, stupid, fake evangelist. So you plotted with them to kill me and inherit my my wealth. Something I've labored for all these years. You will be punished by that of fake God. Jesus, I'm not sleeping with me. What? Ah! Jesus! No, no, no. Jesus! You! 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 Stop on my daughter! You! 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 Stop on my daughter! You! 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 Stop on my daughter! Okay, that's it. I have to kill you! Okay, it's okay. Chief! 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 Hey! Hey! Go on, hand on it. Just go! Come on, Jesus! Okay, now you take them to the gate. Make sure you don't escape until the police comes. Take them to the gate until the police comes. You drop. You go. I will kill you. You drop. Are you? You. I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you. No, wait for me. I'm coming for you. Okay. I will kill you with my bare hands. I will, I will kill you with my bare hands. With all the things you told me over the phone, I know it's going to be very difficult for you to trust again. Did you say trust? Ah. There is no way 
I can't trust anyone anymore. Even me, I cannot trust myself. Just imagine Gentle, a supposed man of God. Look at what he did. What baffled me was that his prophecies were coming to pass perfectly, impeccable. Little did I know that it was all scam. It was all a game of trust. If you can remember in our first meeting, I told you when it comes to supplications, it is the faith of the prayer receiver that matters more. Are you saying that it was my personal belief that made his prayers for me work? No, there is no way I will forgive that man. Never. Chief, unforgiveness, it's like living in a prison for someone else's offense. But I have a recipe for that. You know. Yeah. I call it trust and credit. Trust or credit? What does that mean? Trust and credit. It simply means you trust people on credit so you don't get hurt when they betray you. Well, makes sense though. It's all right. Are you sure you don't want to take anything? I'm very okay, sir. Fine. You're sure? Okay, sir. Thank you very much, sir. It's all right. Thanks Thank a lot. You. Thank you very much. So I should be on my way, sir. It's all right. Thank you. Okay. All right. Uh, trust credit. Trust credit. 